Hi, and welcome to Linear. This video will give you an introduction to what Linear is and how it can help your team. As we jump into the tool, you'll notice two things. The first is that Linear is purpose-built for product teams. It's designed for the way modern product teams work, and it's shaped by the practices and principles of the best product teams out there. Linear is opinionated where it needs to be, but flexible enough to adapt to your team's unique way of working. The second thing is that Linear is fast. It's built to be intuitive, and you can take most actions using keyboard shortcuts or our command menu. Now, let's take a closer look. In Linear, you'll have a single workspace for your whole company. In this case, let's say I'm an engineer at a company that builds a rideshare app. This workspace represents that company. Break your workspace up into teams. These can be organized to reflect your org chart or to group people who regularly work together. Within each team is where their issues and projects live. Standard processes on the workspace level ensure consistency across teams, but teams have plenty of freedom to quickly set up their own custom workflows. Now that you've set up your team, let's talk about how we organize work on Linear. The most basic unit of work in Linear is an issue. An issue is a concrete task owned by an individual that might take a matter of hours or days to complete. We've designed issues to make issue tracking effortless. For example, I can press keyboard shortcut C to create a new issue. You can speed up issue creation even more for your team by creating templates. Once created, issues contain all the information you need to know to do your work. View attached files, link pull requests, read synced Slack threads, and add comments to keep issue updates front and center. One level above issues are projects. A project is a collection of issues that make up a time-bound deliverable and can be worked on across teams. A project might be a new feature you're working on that could take several weeks and cross-team collaboration to complete. Let's take a look at the project Android UI Refresh, where we'll see the project overview and all the issues already associated with the project. The project overview is the source of truth for your project. In the ideation phase, you might start by writing your project specs, then collaborate with your teammates in comments and threads as you finalize details. As your project grows, you can also create related documents or link out to external files such as designs or spreadsheets. Once you're ready to implement your idea, you can convert list items to issues, divide issues into milestones, and start building. At this point, you'll also want to revisit your project properties to update details such as the project status, priority, members, and timeline. As you build, create and save custom views. These help you focus on the priority issues that you'll monitor most often. Project leads can send project updates to keep their wider organization up to date on the progress and health of the project. You can even boost visibility by cross-posting updates directly to your team's Slack channel. To track larger streams of work that span multiple projects, use initiatives. An initiative might be tied to a top-level goal or objective at your company and could span a quarter or several quarters to complete. Viewing all of your initiatives is a helpful way to see your top-level priorities all in one place. That was just a taste of what Linear has to offer, from managing your day-to-day -day tasks to driving company-wide goals forward. I recommend getting started by creating an account and clicking around and exploring. <laughs>